Good morning, Internet friends. That's not very aligned, is it? I should turn that around. Let me adjust that a little bit. Let me see here. Does that work better? How you doing, everybody? So, um, I did just an Instagram announcement. You might have saw that. And now here I am sitting in my World Nerve Center and headquarters in uh, Minnetonka, Minnesota. Got my laptop hooked up here. This is my office. So here's my office, my little bamboo office when I work at home. Other than that, usually I'm, I'm on my phone, but my phone is right there, so I can't show you my phone. But someday we could meet for coffee, and then we could uh, interact and do some... This is a cool thing I got, this little pencil right here. It works as my finger. It works really good to spin through stuff. Who's on here? Hey, Jamie, I just left you a voicemail or a text. Um, so here's what I was going to talk about today. I can't remember now. I, I had this idea in the shower, and now I forgot what it was. Oh, I know what it was. It was all these programs and platforms and social media things that people are on um, and the, the automation of all this stuff. And I'm just as guilty as everybody else. I use automation. But what's real interesting is these automated things that I'm doing, I'm automating with other people. So I've got this thing called, what's it called? It's called Crowdfire, I think. It's pretty cool. Um, it, it allows you to unfollow people that aren't following you and, and follow other people. It's with Twitter and Instagram, I believe. Anyways, so I'm using that, and it automatically sends a message to someone, and then they automatically send a message back to me, and then I have to actually get back into some actual conversation, and that's when we pull these people off of the Internet, this automation thing and get them into real life activity. And I did that with a guy over in Dubai of all places. Um, I was tweeting with him and we moved on to Skype and then onto Facebook. And he might be even showing up here some sometime, but he might, I'm gonna tag him in this Facebook Live. But I'm working at uh, another platform to get um, multiple people onto Facebook because Facebook is where all the people are. And um, what I'm doing these days is lifestyle design, which uh, brought me into another conversation about some people say you should focus on one thing and stay there. But the reality is, is humans don't do that. Nobody does. I mean, even my friend Dave Stahl, which I commend for being very focused on magic. He's been doing magic since him and I hooked up doing magic when we were like five or six years old. He's still doing it, focused on that. And he does go off once in a while and he gets into collecting and things of that sort in the magic realm and magic history and ephemera and all that funky stuff. But everybody does something else. I mean, you get off and he, he used to golf and he likes to go out to eat. He likes to travel. But even in his business where he's focused on doing the magic, him and I have talked that it, it gets to be a grind and eventually he wishes he could just maybe just get a restaurant gig doing magic at the tables and be able to stay home with his friends and family. So the grass is always greener on the other side with everybody. Um, myself, I don't know if I've got ADD or anything like that, but I do have multiple things going on because that's just the way that I am. I've got investments in real estate through REITs. I'm promoting this, uh, this Thrive product because it makes me feel good. A quick commercial, you take a capsule in the morning when you wake up, you drink your shake, boop, and uh, you wait about 30 minutes and you drink your shake, and then I take a shower and I put on this patch that drips nutrition into my body all day long. So that's kind of cool. That's one of the things I do. Then I do uh, online marketing. I've got a website called mysynergycafe.com that's essentially a directory for people to advertise, and I call it Bradvertise because it doesn't just sit there as an advertisement. I actually go on there and propagate and promote and and send it to um, groups that are relevant. Like if someone has got a product that is health and wellness related, I would find a group on Facebook or LinkedIn and I would send that ad to that group of health-minded or wellness-minded people. So it's different than your typical advertising. Again, I call it Bradvertising because it's uh, it's intentional rather than just hoping someone finds it with this keyword. I keep on doing this quote thing. I don't know. <laughs> the, key, the SEO thing and all that. Some of that stuff works when you're a big corporation or something and you got to get multi-thousands of uh, people clicking on certain things and getting the awareness and all that. But for a 
small entrepreneurial business. Um, it's really about relationships, connecting, and I'm showing you my house, and I'm authentic and real and genuine, and I'm not some internet scammer. Or am I? <laughs> I'm a magician, so I will trick you, but I'll do it for entertainment purposes only. Um, so th all the different programs that I've been in, I've been in, uh, here's my disclaimer. I have nothing against these programs. There's just things that I've tried. I've tried multiple multi-level marketing, network marketing things. Back when I was doing magic at a restaurant, a guy prospected me about Amway. So I used to sell Amway back when there was carbon paper and you had to take orms, order forms and write it out. Um, I've done the People's Network with Eric Worre. Um, I did uh, Java Fit with Craig Garcia. It's a nutritional coffee product. I did send out cards. And I'm, I didn't quit these things because they weren't working, because they were working. I, w I was making a little bit of money. But some of them, you know, you just, they just take the back burner and stuff. Um, I was doing World Ventures. Um, I got out of World Ventures because I moved to North Carolina and my team dropped off and I just gave it up. Um, what else did I do on the network marketing realm of things? Um, I can't remember. <laughs> but some people are good at network marketing. They're, they're, there's different types of, of ways of doing this stuff. Um, some people go to these home parties and meetings and some people require themselves to be leaders and develop a team and have the people follow them. Um, other people are utilizing technology. Um, a lot of people, the, the old school people like Eric Worre, he was against the whole technology concept for a while. And now he's embracing it and he's using uh, social media platforms. So a lot of this stuff is shifting over and being more cloud-based kind of stuff. Like, uh, like Lavelle Thrive, I believe they don't, they have a warehouse, but but people don't work in the office. It's kind of separate. And I don't know all the details for it, so I can have my friends that know more about that. But leveraging cloud technology and internet technology, you like this kid from Dubai, I was talking with him today, and he's on the other side of the world. And I had a good conversation back and forth with him. We're going to Skype eventually. He was on the train. so. But the idea of leveraging this technology, you can automate things. And... I'm doing that with some of my memberships and things. You could do membership subscriptions and people get involved with, uh, with a membership-based deal. And the automation will, will uh, um, re uh, recur, recurring is what the word I'm looking for, is it's a monthly billing kind of thing. So you don't have to think about it anymore. It's like with Lavelle Thrive again. I'm on auto ship, so I don't have to think about going and placing my order and all that stuff. It's automated so I can free up my mind for other things. Um, I do that with my bank account. I got a bank account that has a checking account. And then what I do is it automatically puts a little bit of money into my savings account automatically every week. And I don't have to think about doing that. So what it's doing is it's, it's moving the money into a different place. So it's in savings as opposed to in my liquid uh, checking account. And then what I want to do is I want to move that a bulk of that savings into my real estate investments. And I want to do that automatically so that I don't have to think about it. And I can spend more of my free time walking around the lake and having spring rolls at Amazing Thailand and hanging out with my friend Ron. And I was with Ron and Gino yesterday. Um, wonder what else I was gonna talk about. Oh, the different programs I've been in. Vincent Ortega, he had a blogging platform. I was in that. Um, we did that until he shifted it and he sold it. Um, Empower Network, I was working that program a couple of times. Um, the iPass system, that was working good for a while, but things change. And then they, if you've ever seen Blab, Blab was an online video platform. It was working very, very good until the techies got involved with it and they started adding too many features and it got complicated and they wanted to keep it an open platform. So there was a lot of wackos that were on there. So you get in these things and things change. I mean, if you remember blockbusters, they're gone. If you remember 8-track tapes, they're gone. Things are going to change. Facebook is going to leave someday, believe it or not. <laughs> um, I don't know what, the, 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 what companies are still around. Oh, I got some comments on here. I'm sorry. I've been ignoring you people. I can't read this very good. i got to put on my little peepers. Where's my glasses so I can see? Sorry. <laughs> I can't see. Keep going. We're telling you. Oh, you're telling some people. Thank you very much. 
Mike Wilkie, the cartoonist, he cracks me up. And Tanisha, hello, Tanisha. And there's Christian, he is there. That's so cool, he's on the other side of the planet. Anyways, what I'm looking to do is I'm looking to find a different platform where we can have multiple people on here and talk and have a, like, if you're familiar with the Brady Bunch where they had the little square of nine people, was it nine? Marsha, all those people. <laughs> have a grid so that you can talk with other people and it's basically virtual. So I could invite my friend Christian from Dubai and he could tell us about what's going on over there. Um, Jamie is on here. He's in Golden Valley. If he doesn't want to get in his car and drive over here or me drive over there, he could get online here and we could chat and actually have a conversation. Um, Tanisha, maybe she's down at uh, the study in Uptown. I'm not sure. Or maybe walking around the lake with her cell phone. You never know where people are these days. So that's what I'm looking to do. There's a platform called Fire Talk. And I'm not a big techie, so I get lost trying to figure some of this stuff out. If anybody out there wants to get online and talk about how to pull this stuff together. That's what I'm looking to do. I want to be able to have actual conversations like this so we can talk about different uh, business opportunities or just lifestyle design. I don't even like talking, calling it business anymore. To me, business is, I owned a business and the business owned me. And I wasn't able to go out and enjoy my life because I was working on my business all the time. And I don't want to be working in my business, as Ron Orwood talk about. I think that's Michael Gerber stuff about people working in their business versus on their business. So, okay, I'm starting. Oh, it's re trying to reconnect. Sorry about that. It went out for a little while. Must be the internet connection. That's the one thing we've got to be concerned about is internet connection. So I'm going to sign off. I don't like to take too much of your time. So be well. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm going to tune this off. I'll probably check in later on today. It's uh, Tuesday, good news day, so share some good news you got. Okay, peace, love, and happiness. Magic Brad signing off. If you want to know more about me, go to followmagicbrad.com. Okay, enjoy your day. Bye. Click.